Hi to everybody, I'm Andrea Padovan, Digital Transformation Manager in Electron. Let me show you a device that we just created to be able to send the secure data from Kenix bus to any kind of platform in the world. We are talking about this device. These devices have the possibility to use very high level about security, TLS and the mutual TLS. Essentially, we are talking about an MQTTS client that are able to connect and publish and subscribe any kind of data. So, I will show you some example. Later, we are talking about, uh, let's say, energy consumption or uh, occupancy for a building. And uh, as you can see here in this dashboard, you have energy that is uh, a get from uh, a different building. Now we are talking about three kinds of building with three different bridges installed in each building. And then here you can see the active power. You can see the energy consumption uh, for daily or weekly. And then in the other section, uh, you can see here the aggregation about energy consumption of both of all the three buildings. Now I let me show you another kind of platform. This is a Node-RED, it's a very famous platform. You can use our uh, bridge uh, also with Node-RED, for example, to control here we have a very simple example where you can set up an RGB light and here we have different uh, uh, topics that we can control together also with the feedback. Hi to everybody, I'm Andrea Padovan, Digital Transformation Manager in Electron. Let me introduce you the new product, our uh, uh, KNX uh, MQTT bridge. This device uh, allows us to connect uh, all the KNX world, uh, any kind of data that go through our bus KNX, uh, connected directly in the secure way in any kind of platform in the world. We can give you a very high security for our device. Essentially, we are talking about an MQTT client that use TLS 1.3 and mutual TLS to be able to connect in the best security way with any kind of MQTT broker. Let me show you an example of what it means to have an MQTT protocol in our bus. Here there is a dashboard for data analytics. In this topic, we can see the energy consumption. We have active power collection. We have the energy consumption for all day, for all week, maybe for months, maybe for years. Here you can see one building, but we are collecting data for three different buildings. In this section, you can see the aggregation of all energy consumption. As you can see here in the dashboard, you can compute all the energy that you have consumed weekly, in the month, in the year, and even you can compare the different year for energy consumption. Another, kind, another topic that is really important, for example, is the occupancy of the building. In this example, you can see an alternative of the heat map visualization that can provide us the occupancy of the people in the building. Let me show you another example. This is Node-RED, a very famous platform that can all of us to do any kind of logic. Thanks to MQTT, we can control everything everywhere. Here, very simple example, we have RGB light uh, strip there that is controlled. Now we are in exhibition. Our bridge is connected with another broker in Italy and here from uh, uh, Frankfurt, from Germany, we can control in real time the RGB color going through the Italian broker and then the message arrives still here. We have the feedback that, of course, come from the, our Kenix bus. Let me show you how it works.